to feed a loon. I'm Chris. And I'm Wesley. My buttery loon. <laughs> yeah. I'm buttering you that's, up today. That's so unoriginal. I well, it's true. Yes. I do butter you up a lot, and when it's really hot outside, you butter yourself up. <laughs> anyway, we're super excited because we we're are. making something. We're making something delicious yes. today. Imagine that. But we're doing an incredible side dish. It's it's when we're filming so this, good. it's almost Easter, so this is a great it's holiday side dish. Perfect. It's great perfect. for steaks. Let's just tell yes. them. We're doing our whole roasted cauliflower with, with a white, white wine butter sauce. sauce. <laughs> After we got done saying that, we're starving because it, there's so many words, it, but it's so good. It's amazing, y'all. And we're we're partnering with uh, this company called Truly Grass Fed, who are Amazing. Their products are oh, truly tr astounding. <laughs> they are wonderful. Actually, this today we're using what is it? The 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 ghee ghee clarified, clarified butter. butter. So good. We'll talk a little bit more yes, about that. But yes. I mean, just that right there is the melted butter. It cute. just it is, the color is just wonderful. It's it's because it, there's it's there are no yes. antibiotics. We'll, there's, it's, we'll talk about we'll that. We'll tell you a little bit here, uh, more here in just a little bit. Okay, but with the star of this thing of this uh, dish is this beautiful. I think this is one of God's most amazing creations. <laughs> it's delicious. It's so beautiful. Too. It's so delicious. So let's talk about this. Is a whole head of cauliflower, and all, all you really need to do. Usually when you get this at the store, there's still some like little leaves, and so you. Just just get a knife very carefully, uh, just cut away the exterior leaves. And then on the bottom, you're going to want to leave the core intact because it's you don't want these florets to fly away. Right. So uh, I hate a flying floret. <laughs> and so you, then you're just going to, oh, and <laughs> then you get a knife and you just kind of cut away any, if the stem is a little long and it, you know, you're going to leave it intact like yeah. this. That's all there is to it. Okay. So, so easy. So this beautiful ghee clarified butter, we have, so um, I've got three tablespoons here. It's so great. You don't, it's, it's just so pure and yeah. so good. You don't even you have, don't have to refrigerate it. You don't have to refrigerate yeah. it. So, but what I did do is I got three tablespoons and I melted Wait, you it. Wanna, don't you want to oh, yes, fry your right. pan Thank first? you. I, I'm, I'm my Thank cooking God for the buttery loon over here. I know. Well, <laughs> that's why I butter you up. Okay. So yeah, you cook it. You uh, uh, spray it liberally with some cooking spray, and then just place it. You can place it in there if you want, or you can hold it however you want to do it. Because we're gonna butter it, yes. and then we're gonna salt it. Yes. Butter and salt. I, it's so good. I mean, anything with a bunch of butter on it is pretty. I'm pretty telling you. Delicious. And when you've got this kind of butter, yeah. oh, okay. Yeah. So why well, don't you? And so that that color, the the way that the reason why that's such a great color is that it's got a lot of beta carotene and vitamin A in it. Uh, also, it's got a lot of omega assy assy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, what did you call me? Omega fatty acids. <laughs> Sorry about Boy, that. He was he was oh, public speaking was yes. not your uh, forte. <laughs> so good. So so truly grass fed products are are imported from Ireland. And, and let me just say all of that yeah. that you said about the omega fatty acids. Right. That's all really really good for you. It's technical yes. just to say it's good for you. Yes, it's, it's, it's got it's, these wonderful natural benefits. That's wonderful. Yes. Uh, I'm, let me just real quick. I'm going to show yeah. this. So while I'm doing this, you want to also get the underside and kind of let some of that butter oh, yes. go into there and it's going to go yes. on the inside. You're also going to do that when we, when I salt it yeah, too. Make um, sure you get plenty of butter on there, please. Thank you. Who do you think I'm <laughs> cooking for? Okay. Continue. Please. I love this ghee. It's so good. Uh, any, so it's imported from Ireland and it comes from these, it's made, I think it's on 3,000 farms. Uh, and the great thing about truly grass-fed products is, is you can actually trace back where they came from, what cow it came from. So we know where where this what cow this butter came from, this and, ghee came from. And I tell you what, chefs around the world, and we we've talked to some, and, and that's a big deal. Yes. Being able to not you know to just know where your product is yes. coming from. Accountability. It's accountability, yes. and it, you know you're getting quality. Right. There's no shenanigans right. going on behind there, and that just means they pay close attention yeah. to, to the quality. And these cows are. Uh, these cows, oh, I love this. They spend 250 hours just grazing. They I wish I could do that. Well, you 250 days, not hours, excuse me. And no. it's just amazing. And they are, it's, the process is very simple. It's minimal process. It's safe and pasteurized and it's sustainable. And so we've very got- Very small carbon footprint. We've got lots of information about them in yes. the blog post. So feel free, yes. feel free to read about more about them. And we'll tell you, talk more about this ghee as we go along. Ghee, ghee, ghee. it's good. I'm okay. so ghee -ful. So now I've got, <laughs> you're full of ghee, literally. So we've got our oven preheated to 325 degrees Fahrenheit. Basically what we're gonna do now is we just, we wanna get this nice and soft. 
Yes. So we're going to basically, I keep steam saying it? basically, we're, we're basically it. going to steam it. And by doing that, uh, I, now I should also say that I've, you've noticed I put this in a cast iron skillet. This is, I think, my 10 inch smaller yes. cast iron skillet. You, if you don't have that, you can do it in, a, you want to kind of keep it a little snug in there. You can do it in a baking dish, a smaller baking dish. Um, even if you have a smaller baking pan or sheet, you can do that. Uh, but what, by covering this, it's going to just create a natural steaming process to, to soften nice it up. Soft. Then we're going to take the foil off and then it's going to get really, mm, really beautiful. Yay. So this is going to go in for just 15 minutes and then we're going to roast it. Uh, we're going to crank the heat and then roast it for probably another 45 minutes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Open up Let's that do oven. it. Let's do it. Buttery. <laughs> Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. We are getting ready. This is such an impressive dish. So, yes. okay, it's, we're, we, so like I said, after um, it went for 15 minutes, you want it to steam, we're going to just very carefully put on some oven mitts if you've got them and uh, just uh, remove that foil from over the, the cauliflower. And then you're going to close the oven and you're going to leave the cauliflower in there. And then you're going to crank your heat all the way up to 450 degrees. You want a piping hot yes. oven. And, um, Which is what it's doing it, right now. My, that's right. My hiney's, uh, Warm. Well, okay. <laughs> um, so then we're going to let that go from anywhere from 30 to 40, 45 minutes. You just want just it, it depends it. because heads of cauliflower, some are smaller, some are bigger. So, uh, but you, if you just kind of keep an eye on them, when it starts getting that beautiful um, kind of like roasted color, a brownish color on top, yes. you'll know it's ready. Yes. Okay, so let the, we have to have a sauce. Everything Look at this sauce. sauce. So we, you can do this um, in advance, but this it's, it's perfect to do while you're while it's cooking. Yes. Uh, while the cauliflower is cooking. So what I did was I got just like a small um, saucepan. You can do it in a larger one, but the saucepan oh, like that yeah. works well. And we're going to use six tablespoons in all of, of our ghee, beautiful, of our truly grass-fed ghee. Ghee clarified butter. Yes. Um, but we're going to start off with one tablespoon. So you're just going to heat that um, in, in a skillet. And, and this clarified butter is so great because it has a high smoke point of 410 right, right. degrees Fahrenheit. So it's great for, for roasting sauteing, and sauteing. And it just, it's it's it baking. It's, it really is great. I love it. Um, and, so, and also, it's non-GMO. I, for, I forgot to tell this earlier. It's non-GMO, and it's always it has no antibiotics, and it's no growth uh, hormones at and all. It's, it's, it's healthy. So, so anyway, okay. So then we're going to healthy. we're going to melt that, and then we're going to add a half a cup of chopped onion. Okay, <laughs> and then you're just going to cook that until it gets nice and soft and translucent, about two to three minutes. And then we're going to add to that. Here's the trick. Now you may be thinking, wait a minute, I don't like this, but they're anchovies. <laughs> For anchovies, I get them where they're packed in oil. You can do them in water. So just wonderful. give them a rough chop. It's just this texture. I mean, this yes. taste. The saltiness no one will to ever it. know. There's yes. a saltiness to it. It's so you don't so skip good. it. Trust us on this. Yes. Okay. And then you just roughly chop those, and then you're going to put those in with the onions. And I use the back of a fork to kind of just, just kinda mash them it, into those them. into those onions. Yeah. Okay. And now we are going to really start to amp up the flavor, <laughs> and we're going to add a quarter More. cup. More. Key. No, not yet. No, not We're going to add oh. wine, oh, okay. <laughs> some white wine. So we add a quarter cup of good quality white wine. You know the rule. If you drink it, then you can cook with it. Yes. Um, and then let bring that to a boil for about a minute. It's going to cook out that alcohol. And then we're going to add a cup of good quality chicken stock, or you could use vegetable stock mm -hmm. or broth. Um, but anyway, and then let that come to a boil and let that simmer for a couple of months. No, a couple of months. <laughs> you really want it to reduce now. A couple of minutes. minutes. And then we're going to reduce our heat. Heat, and that's, that's when we, when we add, add more ghee. Our ghee. And I love to do this one. We're going to do the remaining five tablespoons. And I just do it one tablespoon at a time. Just melt. let that melt. And you see that beautiful golden it's gorgeous. ghee clarified yeah. butter. This is incredible. It's okay. Gorgeous. And so you let, and the smell is amazing by yes. this point. Melt and it all up. It's delish. Mm. And then we're going to continue building that flavor profile. What we're going to do is we're going to add a quarter cup of capers yes. that I have drained. And then we're going to add some herbs, which is a tablespoon of fresh basil and a tablespoon of fresh parsley and then we're going to do a healthy pinch of salt a healthy pinch of butter stir it and you got that yes. it's ready we are so ready okay so let's get that thing so now out. this is time for the big reveal and i'm so excited <laughs> yay <gasps> oh, that's gorgeous isn't that that just is gorgeous a beautiful side there oh isn't perfect. that just gorgeous and you just want that kind of it's gonna it may get a little smoky in your in your oven you know make sure it's ventilated it's spring so we can ventilate that can is do, gorgeous that is beautiful now, now this now this cauliflower just naturally absorbs yes. the sauce. Go ahead, so I'm just going to go ahead and pour. You want to pour most of it onto it. Um, leave some. Uh, oh. Oh. So, and I, Yay. This I, is so much. This is like a great like thing to do at the dinner table. It's, it's so. so I've always said. 
I don't understand why steak houses don't. Uh, maybe they do, but I think with this with, with a, like a great piece of steak is just so impressive. Oh, I know, I love it. Okay, now leave a little bit of that for our individual servings. That's Thank right. Thank you very much. Okay, and now right. you just in the you just got to be careful if you're doing this because obviously this pan is hot, but you're going to cut it like a piece of cake. I mean, and it is. Oh, yeah. It's just Perfect. so beautiful, Perfect. so wonderfully tender, tender. Yes. And um, <gasps> cut it a like that. There for you. Thank you. Okay, just get make sure you get that all there. the way through there. And then it should stay intact if I've done things the way I think I did them. And then uh, you Got just it. bring this on over. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, Beautiful. wow. And see if you can see the inside of that like that. See, it's just really nice yes, and Yes, and look at that, you guys. Isn't it's that wonderful? So Put that next to a steak. Forget about it. I know, it. I know. And it's also great on your holiday table. I mean, it's something kind of different, which oh, everyone likes. Oh, I love that. Look at that. That is fun. And oh. then what I also enjoy, what I really like to do, is get some finishing salt. Um, Perfect. Just like some coarse sea salt, any kind of finish salt, there. just put a little on the top. Just gives a little texture and a little more salt. That is fabulous. That's incredible. That is so great. So you cut yourself I'm going some. to. Oh, this is wonderful. I love this. This is a festive dish, like, I mean, one of the most festive dishes that we've ever done. And I just Yay! love it. I love serving this. <laughs> All right, Loon. All right, I'm going to dig in, y'all. Mmm. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. I don't know where to go. I don't want to ruin it. I know, I know. You can turn it on its side. Wonderful. Oh, that looks <gasps> so good. You know you have a knife here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's all right. I'm going oh, I love cauliflower. I just, I think it's one of the most amazing vegetables. It's, it's, it's so good. Everyone, I, we have so many, so many of you guys that tell us, like, give us more cauliflower. And so we were like, all right, let's do a whole roasted cauliflower. This <laughs> is Delicious! Oh, and that sauce. Talk about the sauce um, a little bit. Okay, <laughs> it's all about the butter. It all about the, that, that ghee, ghee clarified oh. butter. Mmm, 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 y'all. I'm so, I'm so good. <laughs> it's mm. something really special. That sauce. So, so the the saltiness of the anchovy and then the pepper in it, peppery ness of the capers <gasps> and the, the there's the yeah yeah i know and that it's, butter is just amazing i know it's it really, it's really luxurious is. but somehow or another it's not like and heavy. it just soaks up into that wonderful oh, cauliflower i know i know <gasps> this is 100 percent luna proof yes this i love so it wonderful now we got to tell where can so where can oh, folks yeah, so get you this can get, you can check out truly grass-fed products on at www.trulygrassfed.com mm. and you can look at their products they've got uh, I think they have smoke or uh, natural aged cheddar. They've got sharp cheddar, and then they also have some creamy butter, salted and I mean, unsalted. You want to talk so about good. creamy butter? We love these guys. Really, they are <laughs> top notch. That's a phenomenal. And, and everything from Ireland is really delicious. I know. I love Ireland. <laughs> we love our Irish friends. We love our Irish I love it. friends. Now, we love get... our Irish friends. Yeah. I'm in a loop. I'm just <laughs> so excited. You can excited. get this recipe on howtofeedaloon.com. And many, many and more. Many more. <laughs> and be sure to go to our social media and oh. like us and share us. And you guys, this is one of those things when you this serve is this. It's so much fun. People, it's, it is. It's mm -hmm. fun and it's crazy delicious. Mm. You're going to love it. Mm -hmm. Just as much as we love you. Yeah. All right. Yay. Have fun, everybody. Bye. Bye, -bye. Mm. Make mm. some cauliflower. Mm. Hey, everybody. Hi, guys. Now, if you want to be a part of the Loon Fun, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you won't miss a single recipe. That's right. Oh, and speaking of recipes, if you want another amazing recipe yeah. like this, then just click right here. Yeah, click. Click. Subscribe. It's so much fun. <laughs>